Hey guys, I'm Ruth here. I was working with some redstone the other day and I figured I would try my hands at building a two wide full adder. So this was the first design I came up with and I was pretty happy at the time. But as you can see, it takes quite a while to carry in and out. So I decided to tweak the design a bit and came up with this one. And it's a little bit faster, but not really. So I figured there's got to be a way to fix the carry in and carry out to make it a bit faster and finally landed on this design which as you can see is one tick carry in and carry out and it's only two wide so I was pretty pleased with that let's see how it works So the basic layout is we have inputs in yellow and orange they go into the first um, XOR gate which is in blue the output of the XOR gate is in green goes into another XOR gate which is in blue and the final output in green. And then the carry out signal is in dark gray here and these two torches then send a signal to this lower input of the um, full adder piece beside it. I'm going to show you how to build it but quickly uh, give you a quick rundown of kind of layer by layer design uh, in case you have troubles while following along or you think you've missed something you can use this to see each layer and the parts that are included in that layer. Alright, so let's get to building it. Uh, so first thing we do is we have our two inputs. So they're going to be two high apart, so do that. Then after each input we go up one and two more across. Uh, we stick redstone here and here for inputs. Torch on top, redstone. Torch on top, redstone. Uh, put a redstone torch on the front of here block in front of this one with a redstone torch on top, a block on top of that, and redstone dust. So this is our first OR gate. Uh, you can see it's on and it's on. And when they're both on, it's still on. But in X OR gate, when they're both on, this is off. So to do that, we need to put an AND gate on the side so when they're both on, we can turn off that signal. So to do that, we stick two torches here and here, put a block on top of the bottom torch, redstone on top of that, a block on the side of here, and a redstone torch on the side. So when this torch is on, it's turning off, it's turning on these two redstone wires, which is turning off these two torches, which turns the output off. So you can see when, when only one's on, it's on, when none are on, it's off, and when the other one is on, it's on, but when they're both on, it turns off. Alright, so now we're going to take the output of this XOR gate and we feed it into another one because the full adder is two XOR gates so we take the output, feed it into an input put a torch, redstone torch and then below we have our other input for the XOR gate it comes up to the OR part, we go torch, redstone block, redstone torch, block and redstone. This is going to be the output of your entire full adder once we're done. So why are they in the inputs there? So this is going to be our carry in wire. And now we have to do the carry out part. Oh, no, we have to do the end gate first. So we put our two torches, block on top, redstone dust, block, and a torch on the inside. Now we have to do the carry out part. So when either of these end gates are on, meaning at least two inputs are in, we need to carry one bit to the next full adder. So the way we do that is on this side, uh, we put a block right, oops, yeah, you put a block up there, and we put a block right here. So this block up there is going to stop these two redstone wires from sending signals back and forth, and this block here is going to pull the power from that AND gate and stick it in this block and put a torch on top. So this is the same sort of deal as the AND gate here, as just coming out on this side. And then on this side, uh, we want to stick a block here with a repeater on it to get the signal from that, uh, this block right here from the AND gate. And that's going to be fed into uh, this block here, which is then going to send the signal down to this redstone dust at the bottom here, which is then going to power this block and send us the signal out of the AND gate here. And now when either of these torches come on, uh, it's going to power the redstone dust going into the input 
of the bottom of the XOR gate in the next full adder cell, and that's going to cause our carry. Alright, so once this is done, we can tile it as many as we want to get as many bits as we want in our adder. But before I tile it, I'm just going to add uh, torches on the side here, because when I go and copy this area, these torches are missed out. So if I put torches here, they're then included in the copying, and I don't have to add them later on. So I'm going to set my points for copying. And on the other side, you want to make sure that you get these torches and redstone in place. So now that we have our copy points, we can stack it. So here we have 16 full adder cells. And that gives us a 16-bit adder. For the carry out of the 16-bit adder, all you have to do is stick two torches here and here, and take the signal out to wherever you want to go, whatever you want to do with it. Alright, let's test this adder out and make sure that it's working. So we're going to add two numbers together. We're going to add 4682, which is a 0101, 0010, 0100, and 1000. And then we're going to add 27851, which is 0110. Whoops, I just went the wrong way. Uh, one one zero one zero zero one one one. Sorry about that. Uh, zero zero one one again, and zero one one zero. So when we add those two numbers together, four thousand six hundred eighty-two and twenty-seven thousand eight hundred fifty-one, we should get thirty-two thousand five hundred thirty-three. So let's check. One zero one zero. One zero zero zero, one 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 one, and one 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 zero. Looks like it works. So right now this is set up as Big Edian. Um, if you want it to go the other way, by Big Edian I mean this is your one spot twos, fours, eight, sixteens, thirty twos, sixty fours, etc. If you want it to go the other way, so this is your ones, twos, fours, eight, sixteens. All you have to do is take the the wiring, so here quickly, whoops, all you have to do quickly is take that wiring uh, from the AND gate and send it out to this way. So all you're doing is you're flipping the, um, the kind of the hanging part, right? So you'll get your thing looking like this and torch whatever, block, and then your carry outs as well are just going to be flipped onto this side. So um, you're going to have uh, your repeater coming out on this side, right? It's going to go into the block down below, a uh, torch on there, and then the other one's going to be right here. Uh, yeah. And this is going to be coming off of, so this right there is just going to be right here. And this is from your second AND gate. And you guys get the idea. You basically just move the the inside part to the other side and mirror that, and you get the other EDM. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, just leave them down below. And thanks for watching.